everybody stay where you're at. Stay where you're at. We need fire to roll. Hopefully Faraday. So we're here with Stephen Faraday, and you had an a interesting experience last night. Uh, talk to us a little bit about what happened. Man, it was qualifying. I think it was second round. We went a 91 first round. I think it put us at number three. Uh, 91 at 203. So for the Q2, we decided to step it up a little bit. Uh, sped it up a little bit in the middle, trying to go like an 85 or an 86. And about 150, 200 feet out, started doing a little power wheelie. Uh, got out of it. And it looks like something either in the wastegates or something popped that a little flash fire would cause uh, a little primer line from the primer pump, the electric pump to the mechanical pump, a little alcohol fire. But it definitely looked a lot worse than what it is. Now, you, you were telling me up on the starting line that it, it got a little warm in the car. It did. By the time I, you know, I think I was going through probably 100 and something miles an hour, decided to pull the chutes, get it stopped, uh, pulled the fire bottle. Killed the mag and took one last breath of fresh air. I had a fresh air system in the car. Um, there was flames all around me. And by the time I got out, thank God for this fire suppressant system and for my boots and all my safety gear because from the waist down, it sprayed me and, man, it didn't get burned at all. Well, we're glad to see you're okay. And uh, you never know. Maybe we'll put it back together, right? Oh, yeah. It's, it actually, like I said, the fire was man, 12 feet high or so. It looked a lot worse than what it is. Uh, just the car needs to be replumbed and rewired, and front end got a little damage, a little carbon fire, but we'll have it back in hopefully four to five weeks. There you go. Stephen Faraday, LMR. Thank you.